I'm back. Welcome back to my channel, The Struggle is Real with the Makeup Nurse. Today is Skincare Sunday. And not only Skincare Sunday, but it's June 5th. And June 5th is National Gingerbread Day. Moonshine Day, so let's have some moonshine. I'm gonna, I need some moonshine, that's for sure. Veggie Burger Day and Cancer Survivors Day. And so I'm thankful for all the people who have survived um, cancer. So let's go ahead and get started. I've already double cleansed. Let's do go with the Sea Breeze Toner Astringent to get rid of some more of this makeup off. Yesterday was a hard day for me here. I um, got a call that my son this tie rod on his truck broke, lost control, and hit a tree. <sighs> thank God. The truck is totaled, but thank God he's alive. He's okay. The cat scan, he hit his head pretty good. And he's had multiple concussions. Um, so I was worried about, you know, each time you get a concussion, it, it can get worse. Damage to your head. And I was worried about that, but, you know, he must have a hard head. Everything was fine, and he's home. <sighs> I'm like, I can't deal with any more of this. <laughs> you people need to, I need to put everybody in a bubble wrap and tie them down, and, <sighs> yeah. So that was my day yesterday. All right, I'm gonna use this Clinical Works Tea Tree Facial Sheet Mask. And let's put this on. Okay, let's get this out. Looks very moisturizing. It's kind of cold. It's just a good thing. Let's get this on. I don't think any mask fits my face good enough. That's my problem with sheet masks. I like them better than clay masks, but they're always like coming up on me so okay let's look at what the clarifying and purifying properties of tea tree help tone in any complexion for radiant results refreshing and toning the sheet mask helps achieve spa results at home let's see if it says anything here um the facial treatment masks are formulated for at home spa results cleanse face and remove any makeup open mask and blah blah, blah mask for 20 minutes and relax as your skin is nourished and revitalized. Okay. Okay, while we wait for 20 minutes, um, let's talk a little bit about what I used. So I used the Wishful Genie Clean Genie Cleansing Butter to take off my makeup. And then I used for my double cleanser this week, I or today, I used the Dr. Brandt Clean Biotic pH Balance Yogurt Cleanser with Chlorophyll. And then while I was in the shower, I also used the scalp, scrub, scalp and body scrub for my scalp. I've been using this daily. It's the Wii. I used to have a small sample and I liked it. Um, so now that I got this big one out of my subscription box, it'll last me a little bit. So, And then, of course, I went in with just the Neutrogena body lotion um, from the hotel for my body. And, of course, the butt cream for my butt and it still smells like coffee and look I still have probably halfway so it's been and I use this every day still don't know if I've really seen any results but anyway all right 20 minutes this kind of dried out more um, 
and then some other ones. But it was nice. Put more serum on my face or on my eyes because I'm not going to put additional serum because there's no need to when you have the mask. Okay. Just to rub that in. Put it on my neck. Okay. Let's go in with this Sonage Luster Eye Cream that I've been using. It's getting pretty close to being out, so. But you only need a little bit. You know, kids make you worried all the time. I don't care how old they are. I, they can really worry you. All right, now I'm going to use this Topical C and put some on my hand. I like doing this much better. Rhonda gave me a good, was it Rhonda or Wayne? I can't remember which one. No, Wayne. Well, um, my subscriber Wayne that you might see I think they gave me this suggestion where you put it on your um, fingertips so I've been doing that now I like it it's a lot easier to do it that way Rhonda gives me lots of tips too I learned so much from you guys as well. Okay, now we are going to do lash serum from Lily with lashes. I've been using this quite a while, as you guys have seen. But this eyelash, I don't know if you can see, there's like a gap. So it goes like in a V. And I think, I'm wondering if it's because the other ones grew and maybe a couple eyelashes like broke out um, there in the middle and now it's growing back because kind of like a gap there. <laughs> it's, it's been driving me nuts. So I'm hoping this lash serum will make it grow faster so it can be more even and why couldn't it like on the side or something but no right in the middle <laughs> uh, all right now let's put on oh I was gonna put oil on too let's put it on the retina oil I haven't used this in a while even though I do got a mark right there on my nose but you know what I still need some retinol and I'm using the Sunday Riley Ooh, blue tansy I haven't used this in a while So, and I really like it, but I've been trying to use up some of this other oil. So, I really like this oil. And it's good to have some retinol. Okay, now I'm going to use the pineapple haze for my lip. Balm. It's not really a scrub, it's a lip balm. It's lip butter. But I've been using this like in the day or, you know, whatever, or at night. But then right before I go to bed, I use this lip mask from Seraphine Botanicals. I, I love this lip mask. This is really good too, but this um, stays on and stays moist longer, so I like this right before bed. All right, so that is it for Skincare Sunday with Nana. So thank you for spending time with this Nana and doing Skincare Sunday. Anyway, the riddle of the day is I, I have a long neck 
a name of a bird. If I feed on ship's cargo and I'm not alive, what am I? Comment down below and I'll talk to you next time.